Good morning, family and friends. My name is Therese Murray. And I'm Glenn Strother Jr. And we are here to bring you your announcements beginning the week, Sunday, February 28th, 2021. Attention all new members, aspiring members, and current members. Join us on the conference call for the new members orientation classes on Sunday mornings at 9 a.m. Cal State University of Sacramento will be hosting Super Sunday today at 2 p.m. via Zoom. Representatives will assist individuals with college admissions, financial aid, and etc. These sessions are for both new and returning students, so please, Refer to OLA's website for more information and the Zoom meeting link. What are you doing Wednesday night? You need to drop it and join us in the pastor's Bible study at 7 p.m. Please get in touch with at least three people and tell them to dial in and join us. Hey, OLA and friends, you can make your tithes and offering contributions electronically by going to the website at www.ola.church or give through the mobile app by texting OLOGOS, that's O-L-O-G-O-S, no spaces, to 77977. If you prefer to give via check, please make it payable to OLA Church and mail it to OLA Church, 1250 Sutterville Road, Suite 150, Sacramento, California, 95822. Please do not mail cash because you know what can happen. Interested in becoming a member of OLA? You can go to the website or the mobile app and click Interested in Membership and complete the membership intake form. For more information, log on to our website at www.ola.church or get on our mobile app by texting OLOGOS app to 77977 or you can find us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube at OLOGOS Alive. Don't forget, join us on the prayer line weekdays at 12.30 p.m. and on Friday evenings at 7.30 p.m. Also, please remember to pray for the sick, shut in, and less fortunate. The month of February, we celebrate Black History Month. During this month, we will be recognizing little known Black history facts about the history of African Americans. As COVID vaccinations are currently being administered across America, did you know that incolation was introduced to America by a slave? Onesimus, a slave born in Africa, was a gift to a Persian church minister, Cotton Mather. Onesimus told Mather about an old tradition practiced in Africa of extracting the material from an infected person and scratching it into the skin of an uninfected person. Specifically, he suggested introducing smallpox to a healthy individual to make them immune. This process is currently utilized across the world to prevent diseases and death in both children and adults. Thank you for joining us for worship on this conference line. We might not be able to hug on you right now, but we're still going to love on you and And make make you feel right at home. Now let's get back to the ultimate worship experience. experience.